today's post, we're going to be talking about the importance of the nervous system and its relationship to the chronic problems that you may be dealing with in your health or the health challenges that you have. So whether you have low thyroid or fibromyalgia or dizziness or neuropathies or headaches or diabetes or digestive disturbances, you must realize that the nervous system is controlling every aspect of your bodily function. The brain, through neurological control, through nerve pathways, has a loop going back and forth between the brain and the body. And it is imperative that this system stay intact for your body to extract nutrients from the foods that you're eating. It's important for the nerves to be controlling how hormone releases are being controlled. It's important for the nerves to be controlling how blood sugar balance is going on. The nerve system is what is controlling all aspects of your bodily function. In order for these nerves to function correctly, they need to be fueled. They need to have a good steady supply of glucose. They need to have a good steady supply of oxygen. They need to have certain other nutrients, whether it be cofactors like CoQ10 or the presence of some minerals like sodium or potassium or chloride. They need to have nutrients and they need to be activated. They need to, they like being worked. So if you have an alteration in any of these in pieces of, uh, the, any of these ingredients, you're going to get a change in how this nerve system allows you to extract nutrients from the foods you're eating. You're going to get changes in how that brain is controlling your blood sugar balance. You're going to get changes in how your brain is controlling other hormone balances. You're going to get changes in how your body breaks down the foods to extract the nutrients. You're going to get changes in how the muscles fire as a result maybe causing postural distortion or muscular malfunction leading into pain syndromes like fibromyalgia. There needs to be a balance in the nervous system. There needs to be a balance of the ingredients that allow these nerves to function so that this loop continually happens and gives you all the necessary ingredients to get the control back into your body. So regardless, you need to have this these ingredients in place. Lastly, what these nerves need to have is, a in, is an environment that has no inflammation. And what we mean by inflammation is a, like a smoldering fire inside your body. So just like if you were to smack your thumb with a hammer and it gets swollen and red, your inside your body can have lots of inflammation and that can cause the nerves not to function very well, particularly in the brain. The brain, if there's inflammation in the brain, that's what leads into dementias and brain fog and all those things that you may be experiencing from a chronic illness. What has been found in every single chronic degenerative illness right now, whether it be cardiovascular disease or diabetes or osteoporosis or arthritis or dementias, is that there is a, a common denominator of inflammation going on in people's bodies. And what that means is if the inflammation is not being addressed, you're never going to get anywhere. So you have to find out why you have the inflammation, where it's coming from. Is it coming from old injuries? Is it coming from the stress in your life emotionally? Is it coming from the stress in your life chemically from the foods that you're eating? Are you eating foods that you're sensitive to. So you must realize that in order for the, the body to be healthy and vibrant and working as it should, the nerve system needs to have these loops going on without interference. And as, as well, in order to feed those nerves and to allow them to function well, for them to have these loops functioning well, they need to have proper levels of glucose, which is sugar, oxygen, the appropriate amount of nutrients, and they need to be activated and have an, an environment that lacks inflammation. So keep that in mind if you're still struggling with a, men, any chronic illness that you want to name. Has the nervous system been looked at? Do you have a doctor that understands these components, a doctor that understands functional neurology and can put you on a program where he can rehab the brain, remove the interferences through any number of techniques? And as a chiropractic physician, we do look at the spine, but as a functional uh, as we use functional neurology to approach your health, we are going to also ac ac assess the brain and its function. Is it in good balance? Is it getting all these ingredients so that this system can stay intact and keep you healthy? So keep that in mind when you're looking for a doctor. Do they understand these concepts? And I hope this information was helpful, so make it a great day.